Another night, another big challenge. You, you face a great defense with a supersized front court without Zion, his production, his gravity. How do you score tonight? This is what we, you know, we work hard for. And, you know, belief in our group and no matter who's available, uh, we, we're going to go after it. And, um, you know, you got to relish these moments. Anthony Edwards, when you flip on the film of him, he seems to have added to his game even from last year. How do you go about making life tough for him this evening? Well, you, you got to make all his catches tough. Um, you got to force him to shoot tough shots all night long. And uh, he's, a, he's a phenomenal player. Uh, it's a reason that this team is having success. He's raised his game um, to another level. But, you know, it's going to be collective with all of our guys to be physical with him. Don't let him get in transition. That's where he, he can do damage. And um, keep him off the foul line. They've always been pretty good defensively, but they even stepped it up even more this year. What, what have you seen on film? That, that, why have they taken the next step? Uh, they're long. They're athletic. Uh, Rudy Gobert is down there uh, blocking everything and altering shots at the at the rim. So it allows those guys to pressure up on you, uh, pressure up on ball handle, handlers and kind of funnel everything to him. I don't want to use the R word, but one of their strengths is rebounding. And, uh, you know, that's something that obviously it's been a struggle for you in the last couple ball games. What did you see on film from the Denver game that maybe you can improve on tonight? It wasn't as bad against the Denver, against Denver, but it's just an area we got to keep working at, keep improving, and, um, you know, we will. So we can use the word if we want to. Um, it's, it's, I use it. The guys know it. Um, and it, it's, a, it's a great way to teach is, you know, we have games that we got to come up with big time rebounds. And if we do, you know, you give yourself a chance to, to win. And the important thing is that the guys are working hard. When you get stops, you know, you don't want to give them second and third opportunities to score on you because th that makes it difficult on both ends of the floor. What have you thought about uh, Dyson's progress so far early in the season? Dyson's been, he's been really good. You, you guys can see he's, he's getting better and better. He's getting more confident. Um, he's taking his shots, uh, corner threes, getting to the basket. Um, he's orchestrating the offense. Uh, he, he's going to be a really good player. Yeah, and uh, do you know about Herb yet? Uh, Herb is out tonight. Yeah. And, uh, have you made a decision yet what you're going to do with the starting five yet? Um, we're still thinking about it right now. We'll see what happens. <laughs> And also with this team, uh, they, they present such a challenge with the size, not even just the two bigs, but yeah. with, you know, McDaniels and Ann at the two, Anderson coming off the bench. Uh, what do you have to do just to deal with that advantage they have most nights? We've got to use our speed. Uh, so it's going to start with getting stops and rebounding the ball. When we can, we've got to use our speed. Uh, we've got to execute on both ends of the floor, which we will. And um, like I said, these, these are games that you just got to go at them with everything that you got. And this is a. And th do you think this is the type of game we're getting JV involved more is important? I know that's been a process with the new offense, figuring out ways you can get him into his spots. For sure, uh, JV he needs a big night for us tonight, so we we definitely expect that from him.